It's a nice sunny Wednesday afternoon and we're uh, just going to pop up gyms through the lanes and uh, this is the new uh, prism tube camera with the Wi-Fi which I'm using and Brian behind me has also got one so he's uh, recording me now so it'll be like, interesting to see what I look like when I'm driving uh, we'll switch them around in a minute and uh, for me to get hold of Brian's uh, video file he's going to have to upload it to his computer and we've got our own little uh, FTP site where we upload the uh, upload the videos now so we can upload each other's videos and uh, see what, what each other's what each other's doing. So I'll, I'll probably upload this to the FTP set as well so Brian could see that. to move the mic around in the uh, crash helmet because the other day I was using it I had the mic under the, under the cheek head and it was a little bit uh, muffled couldn't really do the bike properly either so. so you might have an hour come on you've got another 10 more than an hour to go yet down see if it makes any difference with the sound we were talking about the cameras uh, the other day uh, how the camera picks up all the uh, the tappet noises and the engine noises that, that you can't hear when you've got your crash helmet on building more houses up here, more houses, more people in this town, more traffic jams, more cars. I've been wearing a, a brown leather jacket that I've got and the, uh, the sleeves are a little bit wider than this black one that I'm wearing at the moment and the, all the draft goes up your arms so even on a warm day if your, arm, your elbows are freezing to readjust these carbs again the other day because the uh, well I've been using the, the non-ethanol petrol you have to set the carbs up for that uh, which uh, screw the mixture screws in a little bit about, about literally more or less a whole turn in to get it to run right but when you start using ethanol petrol the old plugs stop setting up so you have to wind the uh, screws out another turn so it runs on ethanol petrol. Pain in the arse, isn't it? I think what I'll do is I'll just use the non-ethanol petrol when it gets near the winter. 
so they don't leave none of the ethanol shit in the bikes over the winter period. And they have my indicator on forever. Brian will follow me out on the way up to Jim's and then uh, we switch around, switch around I think. Yeah, we'll just switch around in a minute. That's it. That must be nearly near the time the schools kick out here. Our lollipop lady standing there. Interesting to see what this bike sounds like from behind, whether Brian's uh, bike can pick it up. He's got his mic in the, a little bit in the in the, uh, in the cheek piece, I think. So it's not as uh, might not pick it up as as much as this one. Yeah, find out in a minute. Well, I say in a minute <laughs> when I upload the video.
what he's got to do an oil change on his bike and uh, change that rear sprocket as well for a, a 45 tooth one. It's got, a, it's got a small one to put on it, so. It's funny, my camera just went sort of like uh, made a couple of ping noises for some reason, I don't know why. Maybe it's the, uh, I think it's the Wi Fi that turns off after three minutes. Maybe it's telling me it's just done that. Yeah, with my indicator on again. <laughs> I need a I need a, a buzzer for my indicators. I left it on the way up here as well. You just can't see the headlight that that you know the little idiot lights in the headlight when the sun goes on them. Especially the red ones. Sometimes it like the uh, your oil lights on all the time, but it's just there's sun reflecting in it. Might have to get one of those annoying buzzers when I've got the indicators on. But then again, you can't hear it all the time when you're riding anyway, can you? What's he doing? Yeah, he's trying to get through. I thought he was going to carry on reversing then. There's been a couple of um, times over the last few days where I've been either going to Brian's or coming back from Brian's where up this road where the old motorists don't even slow down, they just keep coming at you so you've got to like get your bike out of the way, do you know what I mean? Like people don't give a toss anymore about motorcyclists. Yeah, maybe I should do a, a compilation of clips of people that drive like, like complete toss pots. Anyway, oh yeah, anyway, so yeah, while we're riding back in, I was to throw one of my latest songs in the mix. And uh, it's only a short song, it's only about two and a half minutes long. So have a listen to, have a listen to this. And uh, have a bit of Brian's video on 